okay, I don't know how well you can see me because um, I'm doing a different kind of video today and I need to be here. So, I, I've done it to my knees so I'm kind of like moving around to make sure like, it doesn't stiffen up because I don't know what it is. Anyway, hello, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a brand new video. For those who don't know me, my name is Amelia and I upload book content such as reading vlogs, reading wrap ups and today, kind of bookshelf and TBR car organisation um, video. That's what it is. Um, and if you do enjoy that kind of content, then please give this video a thumbs up. Please comment down below. Please subscribe. Do all the say, all the social media stuff. You know, you know what, you know the drill. You know the drill by now. I need water. But today, I am standing here. Now, usually, I can see these three past my shelves, and the ones down here I cannot see because I have something covering it. Usually, my DVR cut, um, and then recently my suitcase. Um, however. I have decided and I made this decision I wanted to use the bottom one cannot be changed because I needed a place to put all my programs from like western shows and like I have nowhere else I can put it except on this shelf um however I could potentially put it up there maybe I maybe I might change that in a minute <laughs> but I need it somewhere like I can easily get to and it's heavy and I don't really want to lift it up and down because pain pain there's a lot of programs in there i've been to a lot of shows and there's more to go in there so but we have got one two three four shelves that i'm going to be using and up here we have two box sets that are going to go on my book and my wardrobe so that i can use that one to put more books on display because why not oh we've got my two, my two tbr cards that are a mess they are currently a mess and i'm a little bit like hmm. i know how i got like that but I'm ignoring, I've been ignoring it for weeks and I'm like, I can't do it anymore because one, my books will get ruined if I do that. Two, it just annoys me, but my room was a mess, which didn't help. So the plan is we're going to like organise, I've got a shelf here and needs everything moved and put somewhere. Mm, no idea where they're going to go. I need to ask my mum if I can get rid of something because I really don't want to keep them anymore. Um, and then I've got all the books that are from my box I've read in like the last year or two on here that are going to go on the shelf. And then we're going to figure stuff out. So I'll show you that when we get to them. I'm going to do this shelf first and then we'll do my TBR cards because I think they're going to be the easiest ones to do. Just because they're all the ones that I need to read. And I'm, I'm, if there's one, one that's the most anticipated read, the ones I want to get to sooner. And then there's one just on the read. So stuff that I've read in the middle of a series or, or like ones I'm not that. Like, apprehensive to get to at this current moment they're on this one so i might do a bit of swapsy overs today so let's get on with it okay first of all i have got the fan in the background so if you can hear that i'm sorry but it's quite hot in here and i've just been tidying my room so we're gonna have a look at what it looks like before so then when you get the after you can see the difference so on these shelves as mentioned you saw this this and this and then these ones were covered however this how I've got a really bad knee, so if you hear me say ow a few times when I'm bending down, that is why. This one is all my, like, West End show programmes. They will not be moving. I was going to move it up, but I'm like, no, that's too heavy. Like, it's really heavy. I have got space next to it to put books, potentially, like, a book or two, um, but, like, not many. This, all this is moving in a minute. I'm going to sort that one out next. And then, this is currently the state of this shelf. I'm kind of changing it, kind of not. I will be honest, this shelf might stay similar. Obviously, the deal goes there, but currently it's on my TBR cart. Um, so the deal goes there, and then it's full. Um, and then up here, we've got like, my fantasy shelf. I am making this and this a fantasy shelf, and then maybe a few, like, what's the word? Like, non series video books, like books that are not part of a series, but are not fantasy, like romance kind of ones, if I've got space. Um, but. I've got, I'm going to have this as a fantasy shelf, this is a fantasy shelf, these two as romance shelves. So, mix of both of the things I love. Up here we have, I've got to find a space for this somewhere because I keep forgetting I have it. But we've got the Mindfuck series, we've got the Harry Potter series, and then we've got the Throne of Glass series. That's what it's called. So that's what we've got there. And obviously on top of here we've got Iron Flame, by the 13. They don't match. The okay, so is back. Funny story. Um, you're going to see what I'm going to plan to do with that in a minute. Well, not in a minute, but at some point in the video. And then we have my TBR cards. Can you see the mess? Can you see the mess? Um, we're not going to talk about that too much. 
this needs to be hidden somewhere but i'm thinking because i'm gonna use it when it comes to christmas obviously i'm gonna put it on top of one of the boxes that are going up here and then when it comes to christmas i'm gonna move it in front so it looks kind of cute i know planning ahead preparing so this is all what needs to sort in out these are like the mess of it um yeah so this is what we are sorting out and i'm just going to show you my bed because all the books i want to put on now are on now so we've got twisted series lauren ashes series um some standalones that's what i was thinking of daisy jones and the six we all know is my favorite like this is one of my favorite books in the world look at it tabbed annotated love it so much live for this book Worn it on display. Beach Read by Emily Henry, Normal People by Sally Rooney, Love and Other Words. So we got the Kings of the Wicker series, which started my fantasy world. My fantasy route started with that series. Happy Place, um, Iron Flame, and Fourth Ring, Hardbacks. I've got two lots of them. I, I don't really know why. That is what we are planning to organise. But first of all, let's get on going with that shelf to get rid of the stuff. So. but I want to show you. I was just sorting out the bookshelf and you would have seen and I just found this at the back. I knew I wasn't going to keep it because I started to read it like last year and was like I don't like this. Um, I soft DNF'd it thinking I'll get to it eventually and then I obviously didn't and it fell down the back of my bookshelf and I clearly forgot about it. Um, it's like bent and dusty and just gross and this is how to kill your family by by bella mackie if you didn't know um i will not be reading it it's gonna go in the bin i would try and sell it or give it to a charity shop but it's just so damaged i'm not gonna try and do that <laughs> shelves i'm not going to tell you what i've done i'm not going to show you them until i've done my tbr carts and then we'll do an overview because that's the way it's gonna be but it's time to reach the carts because we've done my shelves i think i'm happy with them i need to get a few little like decorated bits for it which i might get when i go to tk max or hot home bargains in what, end of august um but it's time to move on to these so i'm gonna get these sorted Again, I'm going to time lapse it, why not? And then we can do an overview of what it looks like, and I'm very excited because I'm actually really happy with my actual shelf because I'm just happy to actually be able to see books and actually my bookshelf that is actually being used because I don't have space for an actual proper bookshelf. So I can guarantee you, when I actually move out, the first thing on my priority list to buy is a bookshelf. <laughs> done i'm actually surprised at how quickly i actually moved i did it within an hour whilst also filming so you've got to think like i started filming at mid at 12 it's now one and i've filmed clips i've sorted this out i've put this together i'm quite happy with that i'm really happy with how it's went um we are going to bear in mind when i get to i'm going to take a little like i'm going to put you on my tripod and show you around so you can see but we've got 
fantasy fantasy romance romance on my shelf which i'm really happy with um and then we've got my tbr this is one i'll show you when i get to one of these tbr cards it's just books that i need to get to but there's another tbr card my most anticipated reads and i'm quite excited for them um so now that i've completed it i am going to do a little show of what is on there you can have a little spot i'll show you more what's on there and we'll do a brief overview on the tbr cup so without further ado let's just get on with it okay so i'm now going to show you i'm going to start with my tbr cuts i think and then we'll do the shelf because as much as like i'm really happy now that the tbr cuts are a bit more organized and tidy and my pride and joy is the bookshelf and i think that's the thing i'm going to leave to last so let's show you the tbr cuts so we this is my most anticipated shelf so we have this this shelf is like my autumn tbr with a lot of it being also up here so when i film that video later on today i've got these shelves and these shelves for the autumn tbr and then down here is just another little of books i really want to get to like really soon um but like if I, I mean a couple of them i will be because we have a video that's gonna be coming up in september so these two of the books are actually down now so we love that so this is my most anticipated read, but look, it's tidy. Bearing in mind, Magnolia Parks is on here, and the deal and a happy place are going to be on there in a bit, because I'm doing a reread video that's coming in November. So I'm just leaving them there so they're easy to get to. Um, potentially, or I might just leave them on the shelf and then come back to it, but you'll see that in a minute. That shelf is now tidy, and this shelf is now organised, because I moved a few books that were on here over to this one, um, such as, like, The Chase, Carvel, um and the housemaid's secret um so they've all moved onto there from here so there's space in there so i've organized this and i'm like obsessed with how organized it is now because it's tidy do you know how stressful this was when it wasn't tidy like look how organized it looks i'm so proud of myself and then behind here we have my tbr prompts and a little can maker set because i didn't know where to put it so it's just there so we are now getting onto the bookshelf. I'm so excited. I uh, can't tell you. I, that was a really quick glimpse, but like I said, you're going to get a TBR, like, full on what's my TBR, physical TBR, um, in December during Bookmas, so you can then find out all the books there. Okay, so I put a lot of thought into this, kind of, but yeah. This is, like, what the bookshelf looks like. I've tried to put a little bit of knickknacks everywhere, just so it has a bit more, just so it looks cute. I think it does. But at the top, we have... This, I'm currently reading this one, so, like, I need to just to put it up there to see what it looks like, but I'm halfway through. So, currently reading that. And then, I've got the Mindfuck series, because I need to reread this and annotate it at some point, but, mm -hmm. Then we've got the Once Upon a Broken Heart series here, and I also have the hardback for the, final, the last book. Originally, I was going to sell it when I bought the, set, the hard paperback, but then I was like, no, actually, I want to keep the hardback. So, I've kept it. I think it looks really cute there, if I'm honest. And then we've got my Pride and Joy, the Akatar series. Like, look at them. They're my Pride and Joy, my favourite books, my favourite series. I love them. And then my little, like, toasty jelly cap, because it's cute. And then below here, we have my set my full swing my original full swing and iron flame covers like the original ones you get and i actually forgot i annotated this like look and then so yeah we got the original full swing and iron flame covers and then we got the american cover because i want it in a giveaway which i am obsessed with it's a little bit scratched on the front but it's not the end of the world like i'm not like, bothered i really still love it just just love 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 my iron flip i love my fourth wing books like i love them and um, the only reason fourth wing paperback is up there is because i'll get to it in a minute these books I, it, i'll tell you so then i have my kingdom of the wicked series these this series is what got me into fantasy in the first place um, so we've got kingdom of the wicked kingdom of the cursed kingdom of the feared all by carrie manis galco kerry and it's a carrie kerry manis galco and then we have a little like um trophy thing that i got from when i was at uni and show choir um i can't actually remember what it was for i think i was like i don't know we really don't remember what it was for it was for something the members chose me one of their favorite people and i don't know something like that and then we have the powerless trilogy well the powerless powerful and reckless by lauren roberts so that's that shelf really simple but cute i love it i think that might be my favorite shelf and i'm happy and then we go below and this i'm going to put my knee to get down this shelf is probably one of my favourites. So we've got a little Tabitha Twitch it um, from the Beatrix Pocket Potter series here. This is from my nans and my nan sadly passed away a few years back. And I loved them so got one of them. So I'm going to move it down so I don't knock it and break it because 
and that'll make me sad. We have Archer's Voice here. This shelf hasn't really changed apart from these ones, but we're going to go through it. We've got Archer's Voice by Mia Sheridan here. This is the author's edition, the annotated one, the special edition, because if anyone knows me, knows that's one of my favourite books ever, and I love it, and it makes me, my heart just melts every time I think of it. And then we have the Off Campus series here. This is actually one of my favourite series, again. Um, it's a hockey romance series, if you didn't know. It's by Al Kennedy. It's got The Deal, The Mistake, The Score, The Goal, The Legacy. These two are my favourites. Like my, f They're both five stars, I think. Yeah, I love them both. And then I, I, I think my least favourite is The Goal. I like the score, the least favourite was the goal. And then we have the Chestnut Spring series, which <laughs> took everyone by storm last year, but it's actually one of my favourite series ever. We've got Flawless by Elsie Silver, Heartless by, uh, they're all by Elsie Silver. We've got Flawless, Heartless, Powerless, Reckless and Hopeless. My two, my top two are Heartless and Reckless. I'm going to put you in my order. My order is Heartless, Reckless, Flawless, Powerless, then Hopeless. I didn't love Hopeless. I loved, loved, loved Reckless. It got me out of a book slump. Um, and then up here we have my Emily Henry books. And then my favourite Emily Henry books. We've got Funny Story, Happy Place. We've got two of them. We've got the American cover and we've got the UK hardback. And then I've got Beach Read by Emily Henry, which is my the first book I fell in love with hers because I read Book Lovers first, did not love it. Then I read that and loved it. Read You and Me Vacation was okay, wasn't my favourite. And then I read Happy Place and I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. And then Funny Story, amazing, loved it. So that's my mini Henry stack. Then down here we have, this is a new shelf, so now this is the same. First of all, we have a little, let's put this back up. We have a mug that says Waited to be Wicked, a wee bit wicked. Um, I got this from TK Maxx last autumn and loved it. I just love it. It's really cute. And anyone who knows me knows my favourite musical is Wicked and... <laughs> kind of like reminiscences that I love it. Um, we have my Twisted series here. So we've got Twisted Love, Twisted Games, Twisted Hate, Twisted Lies by Anna Huang. If I was to put that in a rating, I'd do Twisted Games, Twisted Lies, Twisted Hate, Twisted Love. Then we've got my Lauren Asher section. I have got Throttled from a Dirty Air series, but I didn't love that one. Like, it's okay. But these are my favourites. So we've got the Fine Print, Terms and Conditions, Final Offer, all from the Dreamland Billionaire series. These are my three favourite books ever. I love them all. I love just love the writing in that series and then we've got love redesign which is my favorite book i was meant to leave space for um love unwritten but we have clearly haven't done that so we'll figure that one out when i eventually read that book then we have love and other words and normal people by love and other words by christina lauren and normal people by sally rooney two of my favorite books ever and then on top we have carrie soto is back daisy jones and the six and Binding 13 by Cody Walsh, mainly because I didn't know where to put that one at the moment. So I really love this. I think it is just so cute. I am obsessed with how it turned out, and I'm really happy I did this. And then finally, I should probably show you this with the wardrobe because I did move books up there. So we have all the books that I have put on my vintage and waiting to sell, but I might have to take it to a charity shop. All the ones I'm unhauled like a while back. And then we have up here, we have the Throne of Glass series. We've obviously Throne of Glass is not in there, and Crown of Midnight is not in there, because Throne of Glass I have read. So it stays on my shelf by my bed where I put all the red, red books for the year. And then I have, I'm currently reading Crown of Midnight, so that's not in there at the moment, but the rest of them are there. Then we've got the Harry Potter series, we've read up to the fourth, the fifth one is on my TBR cart, and the other two obviously on there. So yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed seeing this, um, these being put together and sorted out and organised. And I hope you like the way it looks because I'm obsessed. And if you did enjoy this video, then please give a thumbs up, please comment down below, please subscribe. And I will see you again very soon with another video.